we, we know that there is um, a lot of ex labor exploitation going on in agricultural supply chains um, and the um, modern slavery and forced labor um, or solving modern slavery and forced labor is one of the sustainable development goals. Um, and so at the moment there's a big need to understand what works, what are the solutions that work to stop labor exploitation. So you could do that in two ways, right? You could just try and set up exactly the same initiative in all these different places with a lot of resources and try um, and, and, and see and most likely fail um, because they will have very different circumstances. Um, or you can actually run these social experiments on a computer. Um, and so what that needs is you need to put in all these different factors and try to replicate that environment and the setup as accurately as you can and then you can actually run a lot many 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 experiments where you just randomly change different factors and the strength of different factors and you can see what impact that would have and that gives you a, a, a better understanding of why this initiative worked well in its setting and whether it could also work in other settings. Yeah, the important thing to consider is it, it's actually about real people, right? Um, and so, the, yeah, those, those models come with a health warning. That is important, I think, when we, when we present our research to policymakers, is about what were the assumptions that we made for this model. Um, because also people might want to criticize that or feel that there's some, an important part missing that we didn't consider. Um, and also when we kind of translate it back to policymakers, um, I think it's, it's so important to, to kind of say, look, there's a, there's a proposition that we make where we're giving a certain direction, um, but that is of course under uncertainty. Um, so it is, it is to help making decisions better um, and at least giving people an indication um, but it's also the, the discussion around it is really important to actually run these results back with people who have to make the decisions and people in the field.